Hey guys, this is Voltage, and welcome back to Crusader Kings 2, the Religious Unity Campaign. It's been a month since I uploaded the last video, and I also recorded this footage about a month ago. A lot of this was due to factors that were a bit out of my control, and I apologize for that. After this video, where my commentary is going to be sporadic because I don't remember everything that happened, the series should return to normal as I continue playing, and yeah. So, I'm probably not going to chime in on this episode as much as the other ones, but I'll still try to. See you guys in a bit. One of my powers as Sunni Caliph is the ability to subjugate other Sunni Muslim rulers. Every 10 years I can declare a subjugation war for a kingdom. And while this is not that relevant in terms of my conquests of the Christian religious head titles and the other Islamic ones, I'm declaring a subjugation of Persia here because if I want to become the Zoroastrian religious head, I'm going to have to have a sizable Zoroastrian enclave so that I'll be able to convert to Zoroastrianism at some point. And I only have that one little county where I married a member of my dynasty to a Zoroastrian person to as insurance of keeping Zoroastrianism alive, so subjugating Persia. I think in the next episode I may try to convert to Zoroastrianism just so that I can get another religious head title and get that over with because it's going to cause a lot of chaos.
officially the strangest use of the Crusade Causes belly I have ever seen. Indian Shia Muslims declaring a jihad for Sicily. That's just bizarre. Well, what do you know? The Crusade for Hungary was successful. Let's go look at the new king of Hungary. Wait, why is that guy still a duke? Cursed infidels, even though I wasn't involved. And Hungary is still pagan. Though, somehow, they've become Slavic pagans. That's interesting and bizarre. Why did the Crusade stop?
Let's annex Africa. I also need to kick these knights out of Constantinople so that I can reform the Ecumenical Patriarchate. Okay, at this point I need to find an Orthodox character and give them that newly acquired land in the Duchy of Thrace so that they can form the Ecumenical Patriarchate, thanks to the stupid Hungarians destroying the title! Okay, with that, the Ecumenical Patriarchate is refounded as a vassal of the Talunid Empire, and I think this is going to be my last comment for the video, guys, so enjoy the rest of the footage.